How to have a better throw and better arcs using Blender's motion path. When animating a character, you will want to track one of the bones. Select the bone you want to track, for example the center of gravity. Go in the properties panel and search for the motion path. Not the object motion path, but the armature motion path. Or you will just get a simple point staying still in space. Hit calculate. By default, Blender will use all the keys of the selected bone to calculate the frame range and the path will be drawn following the head of the bone. You can choose to display the whole path or just a chunk around the bone current position. When manipulating a controller, the motion path will automatically update. But if you are using the graph editor, it won't update automatically. Go to the motion path panel and click update all path. You can now fully track your arcs and check out your spacing and discover my extensive courses on p2designacademy.com.